This week we're making temporary tie bars. The slots are three and a half inches long by an inch and a quarter wide and the material is half inch mild steel. The ramp angle used for the slot is three degrees. The cutter is an inch and a quarter three insert end mill with AP1604 inserts. Basically the end mill will zigzag cut the slot. We'd originally planned on plasma cutting these parts, but after looking at the setup time on the plasma table versus the mill, at three minutes a piece, and the surface finish and the tolerances we're able to hold on the mill, we decided to uh, mill them out, and I think that was the right choice. Let's pause for a second and talk about the fireworks. Carbide can hold up to a tremendous amount of heat and it's not uncommon for sparks to be generated, especially when taking a very light cut or nearing the end of the slot in this case where the chips are thin. The chips generally take away the heat. The heat is so great at this point that the chips are burning up while they fly away. In any event, it's not something to be terribly alarmed about but be aware that you may need to adjust your feeds or speeds to eliminate or lessen the amount of fireworks while you're milling. It can also be an indicator of a worn insert or a broken insert. So listen to the sound carefully and if something is changed, check your inserts and change them if needed. If anyone has advice or other recommendations on how to eliminate the sparking near the end of a slot when zigzagging, let me know in the comments. The tool being used here is a mini pneumatic chaffering tool. It's a very quick way to deburr or chaffer parts before sending them out. This tool uses two carbide inserts and a ball bearing pilot to produce a nice 45 degree chaffer. You want to use the tool in a clockwise direction. You may go around a second time if the chaffer isn't cut deep enough. It's a one-handed tool, but oftentimes I find it easier to use two hands to keep it steady. The parts are then stacked for inspection and then palletized to send out the door. Thanks for watching.